Karen, a win. And after two defeats, that must feel great to bounce back. Yeah, it does. We've tried to um, just regroup as a squad for this second half of the season. And we know a couple of the results that we've recently had weren't good enough. But I'm um, really pleased with the girls and how they just fought all the way through that game. And just um, when the opportunity came to pull away, um, they were resilient and did a really good job. Yeah, how happy were you to see a tight first half, but the hammer really went down in the third quarter? Yeah, absolutely. And we knew um, Yorkshire Jets have been building all year and they've been putting in some brilliant performances. So we knew it wouldn't be the same type of contest that we had in round one. Um, and we knew it, you know, it probably could have been even closer right until the end. So they had to be uh, mentally tough enough to cope with that and be able to um, deliver under pressure, both in attack and in defence. And I was pleased how they pulled away in that third quarter. And looking ahead, you've got an away game coming up, but back here for Easter weekend. I bet you're looking forward to that for Easter Monday. What are we expecting for the next two games? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we're here um, and playing every single game to win. But I think more recently we've been focusing on the process of getting there and putting in really good performances and, and delivering as individuals as well as a team. So hopefully more of that and then the results will take care of itself. And speaking of delivering as individuals, thank you for the setup. Who is your player of the match for the evening? Yeah, it was a difficult one because I thought there were some standout performances. Peace was taking some brilliant balls under real pressure. So the defensive work was fantastic. But I thought um, Natalie Panagari, particularly in that third quarter, um, made a real difference. Just her work ethic is phenomenal. It rubs off on the rest of the team. And she just delivered some brilliant ball into the circle. So it's Natalie Panagari. Thank you ever so much as Karen makes the presentation. <laughs> Natalie Panagara, everyone. A few quick questions, if, if I may, Natalie. That was a really tough game, it looked like, from the outside. The first half especially extremely close. What made the difference in that third quarter? I think just at half-time, we just realised we could take it up that next step. And I think we've been working so hard at training, and there's such a good group of girls here, and just determination just to keep pushing through. And that's something we really wanted to work on, that from the whistle, we just pushed on and kept that kind of domination. And it was such a good game. Hats off to Jets. It was a really good final, but I'm so glad that we pushed through and got that win. Yeah, it must feel really special, especially given the last two results as well, coming back and then bouncing back. Yeah, absolutely. We kind of just, it was a fresh start and we just kind of halfway through the season, we had a really, really great training session on Thursday. And I just think we'll just keep pushing on, keep working really hard and hopefully we'll just get more wins. Sounds like a plan. Congratulations once again, Natalie Panicari.